Hi, I'm Paul Schofield, Wellington's Village Manager. And there's been a lot of comment on social media about how come Wellington's budget's gone from 89.5 million to 110 million. And I'd ask that question too because I'm the person responsible for recommending that budget. So let me tell you about how it got from where it was to where we're recommending it to be. Last year we spent $89.5 million. This year when the cost of living index is taken into account, that take the budget to right around $92 million. So where's the other $18 million? Well the other $18 million comes from two places primarily. About $14.5 million of it is being spent in the utilities department. We have had planned utility uh, projects for the last 10 years. We've been collecting the money and we actually have the cash in the bank to pay for that. So we're taking $14.5 million of the utility money to spend on improvements of the water plant and the sewer plant. And the other $3.5 million is coming out of the voter approved half cent sales tax. So that'll be spent on projects like park improvements, maybe doing something with the swimming pool. There's some roadway improvements in there. But at the same time, we've taken the budget from 89.5 million to 110 million. We've actually reduced the millage rate this year. Council's been very specific about being careful about how we spend money, and they were very closely monitoring the budget proposals this year. And again, when you take out the money that we already have in the bank for the utility projects, and the three and a half million from the half cent sales tax that the voters approved, the budget's really about $92 million, and that cost is difference is really the cost of living increases from last year. And anybody would like to talk about the budget, we've got all the information online. I'll be happy to talk to you about it. Ask us any questions you want because an open discussion is the best way to get information out.